What do we got? Beer! Ooh, we like beer. And it's beer from? The fine folks of Milton, Delaware. Our, Dogfish Head. Our very good friends. Yes, our good friends. Are they good friends like Nick Offerman? They, well, I'm not <laughs> sure if they're that good. Okay. Anyway, this beer is called Citrus Squall. I believe it's a double... Gold nail. Double golden ale. Okay. Gold nail. So they gave us a, a small boy, and they gave us a tall boy. The big end. So we're going to do the small boy, and then yep. we could we could crack this At open. At our with, leisure. We can crack that open with our with uh, the fine folks of the neighborhood one night. Or we could just drink it. Or not. Or not. Yeah. <laughs> so, all right. Or not. So you, uh, we, you open, I... Uh, yeah, I crack, you pour. I, I crack and pour, you read. I read. Crack, crack. Citrus Squall. The double gold nail with grapefruit juice and blue agave nectar. The perfect storm of a double gold nail and a Paloma inspired cocktail. Oh. Citrus Coil is brewed with grapefruit juice and blue agave nectar for an 8% ABV beer bursting with citrusy tequila esque goodness. Mm. This is a golden amber. They recommend you try it alongside chicken wings, ceviche, street tacos, or guacamole. You know, we don't plan properly with the snacks. We do not have uh, chicken Any wings, that. ceviche, street tacos, or guacamole. So we can't drink this? No. You don't get yours then. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> you didn't provide the okay. right things. Cheers. Sir. Salute. Ooh, I like the way that smells. You know, that doesn't smell, at least near the grapefruit, but it isn't like a, like that Scared grapefruit nose. That smells nice. Well, grapefruit doesn't scare me, but that smells nice. Well, you get really kind of tart or pithy. It gets like a little too I, much I of I that. I like all that. It fits my personality. Well, it is true. You are a bit pithy. I'm a little tart and I'm a little pithy. <laughs> I'm a little, little pithy. Ugh. A little pithy. I'm all pith. I'm all pith. No zest. All pith. No. You know what does? You know, see, you read those notes and it's like, yeah, I get that little bit of, you know, like a Paloma. Like a nice cocktail, a nice, nice grapefruit and tequila cocktail. That's nice. Smells great. I'm going. All right, going in. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. I'm getting a little agave. It's a little. It's a little. It's creamy. It's like kind of creamy yeah, and smooth. Nice. I get that little bit of the. Uh, I don't know. Not necessarily. Well, I guess a little tequila. -y. I get a little bit of the what's it called? I get a little bit of the grapefruit. It's a really really nice. Yeah, beer. I get the little tart for the grapefruit. A little sweetness from the agave. That's nice. So it's a double golden ale, right? So mm -hmm. what's that like? Like a. Like what are those? What are those Belgian ones that are like the golden beers? What are they called? Not the wits. Not like, the wheat beers. No, not the wheat beers. But whatever. Anyway, it's good. That's all I know. That's good. I like That's it. Good beer. It's a thirst quencher. Mm. I'm not so sure about the eight percent. You mean too much? It's going down pretty easy. It's going down very easy. And I'm afraid. Very very easy. As a summer beer, mm -hmm. this would actually cause quite a number of squalls on its own. Oh God, I hope so. <laughs> God, I hope so. So, uh, 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 a little hesitant. Uh, as a food beer, this would be really good. I think mm. it has enough oomph at 8%. With, like, maybe some ceviche, some chicken wings. If we had some chicken wings, some ceviche, a little guacamole. maybe some street tacos. How about some guacamole? Be good. Guacamole? Guacamole. A little lengua taco, you know a little tum tacos. Would you do no, tum tacos? No, no, no. Cabeza? No. How about no. cabeza? No. Why not? No. Carnitas. Just carnitas. All right, that's fine. Okay, <laughs> no. That's good. No, nothing. Beans? Can you do or beans? shrimp tacos, just because I like tacos. to rub it in on for certain No, this is really, really nice. That's nice. That's I nice like beer. it. It's got, it, I could sort of sense the potency. That's but it's a, not boozy. No. No, it's not. That's another nice mm. winner for our friends at Don't Fish it. Yeah, I'm not even going to... It's just damn good. It's, it's good. really, really good. It's good. Mm. Delicious. An A? Any other thoughts? Is that an A? Oh, yeah, it's that's good. I, I, I totally. That's an a. I say that's good. Good on its own. Good with food. That's an A. Good with... Maybe some what chicken wings, chicken wings? Or, yeah. or some ceviche, some yeah, street tacos, yeah, yeah. or some guacamole. Hmm. Okay. I enjoyed that. that well, was nice. that was really good. So we're going with an A on this one because yeah. it's pretty delicious. And it's got a little kick, but no bite. No. No bite. No, no, no. So All very citrus. good. So, sir, cheers. Cheers. Cheers to you. Cheers to Dogfish Head. And to our fine friend, Megan Bales, who hooks us up. Thank cheers. you. Cheers.